yes this is the about sentences which is there in your practice book yes let's see first of all what is a sentence okay so then we will go into the chapter so sentence sentence means it should make a, like a sentence when you speak something it should have some meaning it's a group of words that makes complete sense sense means meaningful when you talk something it should be meaningful go park i is it uh, like a meaningful sentence no i i go to park a sentence can be statement question or an order what are you doing here doing what you can be a proper sentence or a question right so it begins with a capital letter and ends with a punctuation mark and has a verb verb means i told you action words i am going home this is a statement have you done your homework it's a question clean the guns this is an order okay so good morning nice to meet you happy birthday i comb my hair i brush my teeth i like my school i love my parents my dad is a superhero see you tomorrow may i come in these are all different kinds of sentences which has meaning children okay we hiked up a mountain the trail was hard we climbed up and up my dad helped me a little the view of the top was great i enjoyed that hike this is the different kinds of sentences which has meanings okay so now coming to the practice book i just showed you you know what are sentences so here you can see in the box what is there i am umbrella i bought an umbrella i am umbrella i bought an umbrella many have i books i have many books i scream he he likes ice cream when you see the column a do you feel like anything uh, is meaningful in this no i am umbrella does it make a sense children no but in b b group you see i bought an umbrella i have many books he likes ice creams these are different kinds of sentences which has lot of meaning so a group of words that makes complete sense is called a sentence okay and the word sentence placed in a proper or always placed in proper order as i told you it begins with a capital letter ends with full stop or a question mark so here you see the example the frog hopped into the river the t is capital letter the starting of the sentence the letter and we have a full stop who is your class teacher is a question where w started with capital letter and we ended the sentence with a question mark right so when we see some sentences here in the page you read the following and put a tick against the correct sentences put a cross against the group of words that do not make sense therefore not a sentence so let us see sheetal is the tallest girl sheetal is the tallest girl in the class so this is a meaningful sentence so we can correct it mark in this gunjan is a good singer good singer this is also a meaningful sentence tanmay has won the quiz contest yes it is also sensible decorated their class the kids on the diwali eve of does it make any sense children no so it cannot be a correct sentence you have to put a cross over there okay you have to put a cross over there so yeah and riddhi has this is also has no meaning so this cannot be a sentence man payal and gauru are good friends so this makes a sense the actress played her part very well correct then avinash ha in class avinash in class what is avinash in class it's meaningless right children are often fascinated by superheroes this is again a meaningful sentence so you can tick mark this and reema very performed well in her exams is wrong reema performed well in her exams very well in her exams right so this is also not making a proper sentence so the last one cannot be a proper sentence okay 
this is one sort of exercise now we have some sentences here rewrite the following groups of words as proper sentences beginning with a capital letter and ending with a full stop so or oh, you know this all right just a second yes so here you see rewrite the following groups of sentences yeah uh, as proper sentences beginning with a capital letter and ending with a full stop so here you know ria r is you have to be capital letter ria is a pretty girl that is one akhil loves working on his computer so a is capital a should be capital children so akhil loves working on his computer full stop alok plays the flute beautifully so a is capital again alok plays the flute e flute e u t i f u l l y beautifully we visited the science museum yesterday we yeah w is capital v visited the science museum yesterday okay uh then we will go for the next sentences yes then uh, the astronaut reached back safely so how to write this the capital the astronauts reached reached back safely this is the correct sentence okay and uh, the next one the new satellite was launched the capital the new satellite was uh, launched successfully that is one more sentence okay children i think you are clear up to now uh, we'll go for the next part okay that is um yes see i am mohit i am 10 years old i study in dav public school i like playing video games studying on computer and reading detective stories these all tell about mohit right his age his school his hobbies so these are called statements a telling state sentence or a statement tells us something okay let us see what they are telling us so i will be going children yeah hmm here we are so now read the passage man learns to fly if my english reader and identify and write 10 telling sentences you know no in the reader you have uh, uh, done some sentences just some statements you have to take and make sentences okay so anything any statement is nothing but a a uh, sentence or a telling sentence or a statement okay so i will write here they were determined to fly like them any sentence from the uh, lesson man learns to fly okay they were determined to uh, play is the next sentence we will take an, one more sentence in the same uh, text mm, like they believed that the wings would help them they believed that the wings would help them fine then one more meaningful sentence i, I would like to make is uh, many people died and many were seriously injured many people died and many were seriously injured okay like that then uh, we'll go for 
it uh, they filled it with hot air and released it they filled it and they filled it with hot air and released it next uh, we'll go for the next one that is um the basket had three animals any sentence is okay it's a statement the basket had three animals you can write any sentence from the lesson children that's a statement okay uh, then we'll go for another sentence uh, like um, a great crowd gathered a great crowd gathered to watch this incident is a sample you can write your own sentences also you can write your own sentences also children okay so needn't worry that i have to write this sentence only that sentence only nothing like that okay so i'll go i'll be writing some more sentences this was the first flight of man this was the first flight of man you can write some other sentences okay uh, the balloon uh, from from the from the text only it was made of thin linen and paper it was made of thin linen and paper and finally people were not discouraged by the fellows anything people were not discouraged by failures this one more sentence okay children i think you are clear with this anything you can write i just wrote my own 10 sentences you can write your own 10 sentences now put the words in the brackets at their proper places to form correct statements okay once a lion and a bear were over a deer fighting dead so how to write once a lion and a bear were fighting over a dead deer that way both to eat the dead wanted animal so how you will write this both yes both wanted to the animal so you have to add sorry here eat the animal like that both wanted to eat the dead animal already it is uh, dead is given so uh, it's dead animal fine as a was watching fight the fox was watching their fight a fox was watching there fight okay using those words in the brackets he quietly the deer went away he ate the deer and went away ah uh, he quietly ate the deer and went away okay so he q u i e t l y quietly ate the deer and went away okay children then we'll go for the next sentences that way you have to make uh, when the lion and the bear got they decided to the prey when the lion and the bear got tired they decided to share the prey but what happened the prey was eaten by the fox i don't know when the lion and the bear were tired they decided to share the prey but were to see that meal had already vanished but they were surprised to see but they were surprised the bracket words i'm using children 
they were surprised to see that they are they meal were had already vanished fine children these are the things so here we will do and later we'll continue okay thank you so much children